This is two dimension. Right? The surface is two dimension. This is two dimension. If you want to go up, it's three dimension. So this is three dimension. This object is a three-dimensional object. You know, very clear. Now, you want to see a four-dimensional object? That's what it's not, because a four-dimensional object does exist. It exists only as a... Yeah, if I do it like this, this is a four-dimensional object. But you don't know where every element is. Time. And every time you see, it will be different. If you touch it like this, it's another different. Every time you touch it, you get another different. So it's always different. If I touch it like this, if I touch it like this, the circle doesn't, the center doesn't move. It's different. Because here, it's every time it's unexpected, it's a new, if I touch it like this, just the center move. So every time you touch it, it may get another movement. If you touch it like this, it changes the shape. Oh, now it looks like a Viking ship. And if you touch it like this, it can take any shape. Do you think it's now the last shape or it still may continue to change? Continue to change. Do you know how it will change? Well, I can think of other ways to change it. Yeah, but do you know how it will change now? How it will change now? If you push it the other way? You can push it, but you don't know exactly. You may mm -hmm. know. No. You guess. Right. But that's very important no. because when you look at the painting, this would change, it would not change. It's not to the past. No, Once it's done, it will not to the past. But in reality, everything you do is unexpected because something may happen. That's another dimension. And that was never introduced in art. Mm -hmm. In art, whenever it's done, it's always been to the past. Stopped, it go to the past. And here is something that every time you touch it, for example, here, instead of opening inside, I'll open it, for example, this way, inside. I'll make it open like this. It's different. I make it like this. The number of changes are unexpected and different. So there's infinite numbers of them. Infinite number. Yeah. Because it's, time is something new and unexpected. Let everybody continue.
great thing for kids. Kids, kids like to do things, even if it's just a, two erasers, they'll find something to do with it. Good, very nice.